Hi, Monsieur Fadiop. You are CTO at Sopra Steria Aeroline. I'm Thomas Pagbe, journalist at IT4 Business, and I'm pleased to be with you today. Um, I have some, some questions to, to ask you, but before that, uh, could you please introduce me to your company and uh, describe the service you offer? Hi, Thomas. So, I'm very pleased to be here. So, um, Sopra Steria is a, a, a French company, a French-based company, but also a global European uh, IT services company, providing multiple uh, consulting services, software development, uh, and also working on a lot of, uh, I would say, industries uh, regarding IT uh, and, uh, and developing uh, some software for our, our customers. Who are those customers, and uh, what are their challenges and especially um, uh, on the, the SAP environment? We have, uh, as mentioned, we have a lot of customers, um, large companies, uh, almost uh, large companies, organizations, mm -hmm. um, and we, we have uh, 11, we say, areas where we are working uh, uh, all, all the year. And my domain is dedicated to aeronautic and, sp and space. So the challenge in my in my area is uh, to provide, I would say, the best uh, solutions to help our customer to to, to grow for sure, mm -hmm. uh, and also to be able to to continue on their business activities independently uh, of the demand from the market and so on. And especially. I'm working with a, a big aircraft manufacturer, an European uh, aircraft manufacturer. You may you may be aware that we, they have a, we have faced a, a big uh, crisis a uh, few a few years ago. They were able to manage a, a huge ramp down and now a huge ramp up, just to adapt to the market because no 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 aircraft will, were, were flying I would say two years ago and now we have some huge uh, I would say uh, traffic jam in each and every airport. So that, that's. Variability in the market, we need to support our customer to adapt every time. What are your expectations um, from your cloud provider, which is, as we speak, uh, OVH Cloud? Many expectations, but uh, one thing I would say as a basis is, yeah, you know, to benefit the, the, the robust infrastructure, to be able to run on top of this infrastructure. The, the, the software for our, uh, and especially ACP as an ERP. And we need this kind of, I would say, robust, flexible, scalable infrastructures, compute resources that we need uh, to, to be able to run our software on top of that. Also, we need uh, to uh, provide the best level of security. We also need to uh, meet some customer requirements. You know, we are more and more aware about sustainability in the aeronautics sector. So we need uh, to be sustainable at each and every level of the design of our solution. It starts from a Soprasteria level, for example. Our company uh, has a target to be uh, zero emission, net, net zero emission by 2028. And it starts by ourselves. And then also we give our own knowledge and experience on sustainability, how to design uh, in an eco-friendly uh, way our software, we need to put this on the market and give this possibility to our customer and then design for them the best software solution. And then at the end, because an aircraft, for example, in, a, in our sector, uh, need to be sustainable, so they optimize, I would say, everything regarding the fuel consumption, optimization about, you know, the aircraft flight and so on. But uh, it starts by the design of the aircraft itself. And we provide software for designing uh, those aircrafts. PLM software, for example, and then we need to provide the best solution and the best algorithm uh, to, to, be, to be sure that when it will run on top of OVH cloud, which is basically also sustainable, mm -hmm. then they will benefit also from the best uh, solution uh, in terms of uh, sustainability. So you choose OVH cloud because you want it to address really specifically, strongly uh, this uh, topic of sustainability. Yeah, absolutely. This is uh, really a, a, a game changer, we say, because uh, we know that making a, a stack of different uh, sustainable solutions will lead to a, a, a great solution that, uh, when, when we reach the, the, the overall solution. But another point is also, you know, the sovereignty. And Overash Cloud is now, uh, you know, uh, really compliant with data sovereignty. Uh, it's, uh, we have some regulation here in France uh, called Segment Cloud, which uh, OVH is providing to, to their customer and we benefit from their certification to build and to run software in a secure environment, in a data sovereignty environment, and that's really key for our customer in this domain. You know, there is a, a lot of competition in this market, 
and they need to be sure that that data will not go away uh, and they need to keep we say an end all their, da all their data and this is why uh, OVH is really interesting uh -huh. for us. One uh, last question is what what are your thoughts on um, the, the way the market will uh, will evolve and precisely on your sector. So the market is moving fast, uh, re really fast. And you know, we have almost our, all our customers are running SAP for more than 20 years so on premise, for sure. And now they need to benefit uh, from the latest innovations uh, uh, provided by SAP on one hand and providing by the, the rest of the market in terms of IT systems and software and so on. So they need to put everything just to be uh, able to address also their, uh, their own market. All those things are really, really moving really fast. So we need to, to tackle all those issues mm -hmm. to build solutions and move and accompany our customer on, uh, on, that, uh, on that way. So it is the end of this interview. Thank you, Sufa. My pleasure, Thomas.